Hi everyone, it's Miss Anders here. I have another story for you. The little red hen. Let's see. Ooh, exciting. One sunny spring morning, the little red hen was scratching about in the farmyard. Suddenly, look, look, clocked the little red hen. I spy a ear of corn. The little red hen was very excited. She showed it to her friends in the farmyard, but they didn't look very interested. Who will help me to plant this corn? She asked. Not I, yawned the sleepy stripy cat. Not I, sniffed the sleek skinny rat. Not I, snorted the plump pink pig. Too busy. Then I will plant the corn myself, said the little red hen. And she did. It will never grow. The little red hen weeded and watered the corn every day. Soon the corn began to grow. Grow corn, grow. It grew and it grew and it grew till it was tall and golden. Who will help me to cut the corn? asked the little red hen. Not I purred the preeny stripy cat. Not I sung the snoozy skinny rat. Not I mumbled the muddy pink pig. Too busy. Then I will cut the corn myself, said the little red hen. And she did. It's ripe and ready. Wow. Who will help me to take this corn to the mill? Asked the little red hen. Not I, said the big stripy cat. Not I, shouted the small skinny rat. Not I, laughed the large pink pig. Then I will take this corn to the mill myself, said the little red hen. Ah, she did. Round and round went the windmill as it ground the corn. Soon the little red hen had a big sack of fine white flowers to take home. She was very pleased. What shall I bake? Who will help me to bake some bread? Asked the little red hen. Not I called the cold up stripy cat. Not I said the sneaky skinny rat. Not I giggled the gleeful pink pig. Too busy. Then I will bake the bread myself, said the little red hen. And she did. Mm. Who will help me to eat this bread? Asked the little red hen. I will, said the eager stripy cat. It smells so delicious. I will, said the hungry skinny rat. I love freshly baked bread. I will, said the greedy pink pig, with lots of creamy butter, please. But the little red hen had other plans. Not you, stripy cat. Not you, skinny rat. Not you, greedy pig. You didn't help me at all. So now I'm going to eat this warm, fresh bread all by myself. And she did with all those of creamy butter. Mmm, delicious. Remember boys and girls, always to help others. See you later.